Corn Saturday before the game down on the field, I, I saw you being really verbal. Had a lot of the, the players around you and kind of trying to pump them up. That's really the first time I can remember seeing that out of you. Just kind of talk about what prompted you to do that and that, that progression for you as a player and a leader. Um, you know, it, it's, a, it's a process that I have to go through. I'm not much of a vocal leader. You know, I, I rather lead by action. But, you know, it, sometimes, you know, you just have to say what's on your mind. You know, I felt that this is one of those games that we needed to turn our season around. You know, I, I, I felt that we all needed to give the best possible effort. And I just wanted the players to know that I was going to give my all and all I had. And I just wanted the same kind of effort out of them. Is it is it hard for you to be that vocal leader? I mean, because it isn't your personality, is it? Is it hard for you to kind of put yourself out there like that in front of the guys? No, it's not hard at all because, you know, I, I've learned to adapt to situations in the past, you know, and I'm, I'm becoming a very vocal leader, you know, I don't say a lot, and I bite my tongue a lot, but when, when I have something on my mind, you know, and, and some of my conscience, I'm going to say what I have to say, you know, uh, my players may not like it, and sometimes I may, you know, be vocal with it, but I, I just want to say what's on my mind. It, it's not, you know, to point anybody out, it's just I want to say it and get it, and get better as a team, you know, get it corrected. And, you know, give them the, the faith that I have in them, and I hope the faith that they have in me so we can come together and you know, be a great dominant team. It's really funny because Carrico mentioned that yesterday, you know, as, as you being a leader Saturday and kind of being more vocal, and a couple other players have mentioned it. So is this the mantle that you want to take on now? It's kind of like that, that vocal guy for the defense. Uh, I think it's, going to, it's, it's a challenge that I'm willing to take. You know, uh, somebody's got to step up and be a vocal leader and an action leader. And, I, and uh, I think I'm capable of doing both of them, so I'm, I'm really trying and attempting to step up to the plate. It's just a different Daquan this year. Is there one thing, two things that, that have kind of prompted all this? Or just, is it just maturing? It's just maturity and having a great offseason, thanks to the coaches and the conditioning staff. Appreciate it.